Monday, the 25th of January, 2016, in the cave of Tamara, in meditation towards peace, in Syria, in Middle East, peace on this planet Earth. I connect with all the refugees. With my heart, I see the people on the ocean with the last hope to survive. And in front of my eyes, I see how they are landing in Lesbos and how many of my friends are there just now trying to help. I give thanks to all these helping people. And I call the spirit of life, I call the spirit of universal love to give messages to us and to the world how this war can be end. Imagine that the money will no more be invested into building weapons. Imagine that worldwide communities come together in deep solidarity to develop a system of research how peace can be unfolded on this planet. Imagine that they all invite refugees to their centers to come together to understand the universal laws of community building. Imagine that in Lesbos and at many places on this planet this kind of new universal communities will be built, developing truths together, developing a deep solidarity, developing the capacity to really listen to the laws of the life. Imagine that together we will discover the laws of love. Imagine that we don't follow anymore the laws of religion. Built because of power systems, suppressing the real life sources of human beings, especially of women, but also of men. Imagine that we come to a form of life where the errors will no more suppressed, will no more be suppressed, where errors will guide us to a very sensitive truth of how a woman wants to be touched and how a man wants to land in the embracing arms of a loving woman. Imagine this will no more guide towards violence. This will guide to an open heart and humanity, taking care for all life. Imagine we build the first communities which are fully committed to step out of the system of war. Imagine we build communities which can show what sustainable life will be like, look like. Imagine that the money system is surfing this peace development. All the refugees will learn together and will study together with the communities in Europe and at other places in this, on this world how we can support the healing on this planet. <coughs> we will take care on an ecological, technological and social life where a new culture can be born, a culture of trust. No government will have power by working towards war. No contract of building weapons to build the economical system more powerful will work anymore.
because we stepped out. More and more soldiers will put their guns down. More and more ES fighters will discover that they can find other ways to land in the arms of the mothers, of the sisters and the beloved women which were not allowed in their system of religion. Imagine we will develop the capacity that all this hatred can be guided back to a real, innocent, open, loving heart. Let us find ways to go in this direction. <coughs> Let us take to our heart that we have the capacity to go back to the universal laws of life and that nature and the organism of Mother Earth will show us how this can happen. Together we can start to discover how much we ourselves still live in a system of war and defense or offending people. Listening to the laws of the universal life, listening of polarity which is in life of matter connected with unity will guide us. Beyond the question of being bad or good, we will find the real laws if we don't suppress our real life sources anymore and if we really are ready to listen, to touch with love and to follow the universal creation which created us. Our system of society wants to be built back to universal society. Community will be built worldwide while taking care for sustainable laws of life and love. We greet all the helpers in the refugee camps. We send them our energy and we will do our work at our places to prepare this kind of systems, to do the inner peace work what is necessary to become a real peace worker on this planet. Thank you for all invisible helping sources. Thank you that we can build back the trust in our heart to be ready to go. Thank you. <laughs>